In this video, I want to demonstrate a new tool we've added called Cross-Section Navigator. And you can find that on the Drawing Production tab um, in Open Roads Modeling in between the Annotation and Name Boundary tool. Um, and what, what that tool is going to allow us to do is quickly navigate our sections. So just to refresh, you know, I've got a file here. I've got several drawings uh, created from name boundaries for cross-sections. And uh, previously, if I wanted to go to a particular cross-section and review it, I'd have to switch to that view group or, you know, switch to that drawing model or sheet model. With, um, with the cross-section navigator, I activate the tool here. I come and um, select my alignment, and then I select a view, and it will <coughs> fit the first cross-section to that view. And you'll get this little dialog here, uh, cross-section navigator dialog, where you can navigate through. So I'll expand this view a bit so we can um, see it. Um, so we've got the, the name of the group that this cross-section belongs to. Um, I've only got one group in here of cross-sections. And then these are all the different cross-section models that it found. So we've got navigation here. I can, you know, go to the next cross-section. I could, you know, I could fit view. I could zoom in on a cross-section. Um, you can go scroll forwards, go backwards, obviously. You can fast forward to the end, go back to the beginning. Um, the nice thing about it is if I am I reviewing a particular portion of my cross-section, as I step back or through other cross-sections, it maintains my zoom. So it's not, re it's not zooming out every time. Um, if I want to zoom out, then I simply just hit the fit view on that. So just a quick tool, I can jump to a particular cross-section of interest. It'll fit me there. <clears throat> so it's just switching and bringing in those name boundaries that I choose. So that's the new cross-section navigator um, that'll be out in 2021 release one. Thank you.